When I think about the edge, I really start thinking about distributed infrastructure. Because when we talk about edge, it's not just what's local to you, it's actually about how what's local to you is connected to everything else, other sites, other people, the cloud itself. So we really start thinking about much bigger problems, distributed computing problems, and thinking about how all of this has to work together in new ways. Hello, I'm Rob Hirschfeld, CEO and co-founder of RackN, and you know I'm very excited to be part of the LF Edge because what we've really done here is we've unlocked a whole new category of infrastructure innovation and an opportunity for people to invent and create new things. Because as much as the cloud has unlocked this, you know, centralized computing and cheap infrastructure and things like that, it really hasn't helped us do compute in our daily lives, interact with things and other people and devices and, and capabilities that you know are in our environment and close to us. And, and that really has been a, a huge gap in the, the next generation of where technology needs to go. RackN specializes in automation and infrastructure and sort of building the building blocks of, of compute and network and storage and all these pieces that you need to build real computing platforms under the cover. And that's why LF Edge to us has been really important. If you think about LF Edge and how we're going and deploying you know, infrastructure that is available for everybody using open source technologies, what you, you look at is this much broader spectrum of infrastructure than we're used to thinking about. Small devices, inexpensive devices, uh, ARM, like Raspberry Pis even, and, and embedded units. And so there's a lot of capabilities here for us to think about how all these pieces fit together and how we automate it. And it's, it's incredibly tricky. The embedded devices don't really do provisioning and automation the way we're used to doing it in the data center. They either don't have the, the capabilities or the protocols or the toolkits. Um, and that's why things like secure device onboarding um, become a really important component because we need to have a way that brings all these different pieces and parts in into a secure framework. Um, you know, that's where something like um, EdgeX, where we can pull in pieces where there's containers and it's very easy to deploy the application components I need and talk to the protocols that I want. All of those things have to be considered. And then that builds into a broader distributed infrastructure because while we can get one site to work, we actually have to build thousands, hundreds of thousands of sites all fitting together. And this is really where the community aspect of what we're building with LF Edge is important and something that people should consider. So what I hope is that people think about not just how do we deploy applications in here, but how do we build sustaining infrastructure and, and make things work? That's why RackN's involved in LF Edge and that's what we're really excited about being a part of. That's the community that, that for us really brings a lot of value. Thank you.